40 miles south of San Francisco, an industrial giant is spewing dangerous pollutants into the local air and water. The offender, a large cement manufacturing plant in Cupertino, is a major source of mercury, a potent neurotoxin that poses significant threats to human health and the environment. Tucked away in the hills just west of Cupertino is what appears from above to be a moonscape, a large area amidst the otherwise verdant hills that has been scraped of trees to expose the rock beneath. What is this large scar? Called a quarry, it is a 600-acre open pit mine that supplies limestone and other materials necessary to make cement to the nearby Hansen Permanente cement kiln. These photos, taken in 2008, provide a close-up view of the damage inflicted upon the local landscape. Local residents are currently fighting a plan by Hansen Permanente to significantly expand the size of mining operations. Just downhill, the kiln makes cement by burning coal and other materials to heat the limestone, a process that releases mercury and other pollutants through the plant's smokestacks. Hansen Permanente's self-reported emission data shows the kiln has released, on average, more than 400 pounds of mercury per year since 2000. But an Earth Justice report published in 2008 showed that companies throughout the country have grossly underreported mercury emissions from their kilns. Unfortunately, the Cupertino cement kiln wasn't included in the Environmental Protection Agency's monitoring data, so its actual mercury emissions remain a mystery. Air pollution drifts over the surrounding communities, home to hundreds of thousands of people and numerous schools. Mercury enters San Francisco Bay rapidly and accumulates as methylmercury in many large fish and shellfish. Because consumption of contaminated fish is the main way people are exposed to mercury, the EPA warns residents to limit eating striped bass, sturgeon, or other sport fish caught in the Bay or Delta. Pregnant women, small children, and individuals whose diets consist heavily of seafood from contaminated waters are especially at risk. While the Bay's mercury problems aren't due solely to Hansen Permanente cement, cleaning up the toxic mercury emissions from Cupertino cement kiln will certainly make an impact. After years of ignoring the issue, the EPA is finally poised to regulate mercury pollution from cement kilns. Earth Justice has been in this fight from the beginning and will continue to work to clean up this threat to our health. To learn more, visit earthjustice.org slash mercury.